Good afternoon, it's Facebook Live from Paul's Photo and the Creative Photo Academy. I'm here hiding in the tripod jungle. That's right, because I want to talk to you guys about tripods today and what I like in a tripod. So it's Mark Coleman from Paul's Photo, the Creative Photo Academy in the lab at Paul's Photo. And I want to talk to you about four Mark approved tripods. And what does a Mark approved tripod require? It requires three things. Number one, carbon fiber legs. Number two, the screw type legs. And number three, an Arca Swiss style quick release plate. And the advantage of that is I can put any of my cameras and any of my lenses on all of the tripods we're gonna look at today. So if you are looking for a compact, small tripod, the ProMaster 525 is awesome, $269. It's a great travel tripod. It'll go in your saddlebags on your bike. It'll go in your suitcase for traveling. Lightweight, small, easy. If you want something that's more rugged, this is the Sarai waterproof tripod, $499 with the head. It's a little heavier, but it's waterproof. So if you're in adverse conditions, in the sand, in the desert, in the river, this is an awesome choice. This is my new compact favorite. It's the Benro Tortoise Tripod. And you'll notice that it's a little bit smaller, a little bit lighter weight, about three and a half or four pounds, $449. It's the right price for me with the head. And I like it because it folds up small and it doesn't have a center column. Just like my big pro tripod, this is the Getso 3544. I love it. You've seen me use this in my Be Creative videos, but it has the same technology. Carbon fiber legs, screw legs, Arca Swiss style mount. So I'm going to show you here with the tortoise. And I love the Benro tortoise. They just came in this week. It's a brand new tripod. Lightweight, small, fun, easy. Now, a lot of you have complained and said, you know, Mark, I want the old style tripod with the screw on the top. That sucks. <laughs> you don't want to use the little plate that comes with the tripod either because those twist. What you want is you want, so here's my camera bag, my Mindshift First Light 40. In here I have my Nikon Z7. And you can see I have an L bracket. So we carry the Sunway and the ProMaster L brackets. And this is custom made exactly to your camera. So it doesn't twist, it doesn't move, it's really rock solid, it's awesome. These are 60 or $70, so that's not a lot of money. The other thing this allows me to do is you can see my peak strap, my favorite strap here, is mounted sideways. So when I'm going on and off the tripod, the strap is out of the way. And when I'm carrying it, the camera carries vertically so it's smaller and lighter against my body. So these are the tricks that a pro is going to teach you. That's why you come to Paul's Photo for your help. You come to the Creative Photo Academy for your classes because we're going to help you with all this stuff. Now, what's the cool thing about the L bracket? I have the quick release plate on. Boom. My tripod is on. I can carry it like this. It's not going anywhere. So I've mounted the camera on the tripod, I adjust it, and with a ball head, lock it down, we're good to go, it's rock solid. Now, why the L bracket? Why on this side? So if I wanna go from port landscape to portrait, with a traditional tripod, I have to do this. That takes a lot of time and it changes the image. With an L bracket, you just flip. And it's so much easier to go from portrait to landscape and that's so cool and that technology with the Arca Swiss plate and the L bracket on my camera fits on all of the four tripods and most of the tripods here we carry at Paul's Photo it's awesome another cool feature is with the Arca Swiss style plate not only do we put this tripod mount on our cameras we put it on our lenses so a lot of our telephoto lenses today have the tripod mount on them, and we're going to use the Arca Swiss style plate. So boom, now the lens goes on the tripod. And that does two things for us. Number one, it mounts the tripod at the center of gravity at the camera lens combination. It's going to make the tripod easier to hold it stronger. 
Now, I'm gonna then adjust the, camp, adjust the view like this, boom. Let's say I wanna now flip from portrait to landscape, because my camera's in portrait, I loosen, and now I rotate the camera to landscape. How genius is that? So you don't have to tip it over, all that shenanigans you used to have to do, right? Landscape, portrait, just that simple. Are there any questions, Jerry? Is everybody out there? Can you guys give me a hello? Can you give me a wahoo? Can you send me an emoji, right? Because I'm just giving it all up for you. I need to know you're out there and having fun at lunchtime on Friday because it's a fantastic Friday. We're talking about photography. What can be better than that? So what do I like in a tripod? Carbon fiber legs, screw type legs, Arca Swiss mount. And whether you want a small, a medium, a large, or an extra large tripod, that's up to you. I'm gonna recommend you spend about 450 or 500 bucks on a tripod. This is the new Benro Tortoise, my new favorite compact tripod. It's awesome, it's gonna rock, I'm excited about this. So you've got my Nikon Z7, mirrorless full frame. We should all be converting to mirrorless full frame, whether it's Nikon, Canon, Sony, or Panasonic, it doesn't matter, these cameras rock. Update your lenses to the new high quality mirrorless lenses. So the Canon EOS R lenses, the Nikon Z lenses are absolutely the best lenses I've ever shot in my life. Any questions, Jerry? Awesome, everyone. Happy Friday to all. I can't wait to take pictures with you. We'll be out there soon. Remember, we've got a trip to Joshua Tree coming, two trips to Joshua Tree coming up in September, the weekend of December, September 11th, 12th, and 13th for light painting, September 17th, 18th, and 19th for star trails. So the end of September slot canyons in Arizona. Got room on all three of those trips. If you want to join us, we'd love to have you. We're going to be safe. We're going to be distanced. And I can't wait to take great pictures. Anything, Jerry, anybody on there? There's anybody, yeah, there's a lot of people on there. Good. Anybody giving us some love? Mm, no. PDK is PD, PD in there. All right. I want some love. I want some emojis. I want some fun. And I want you guys to have a great weekend and take some pictures. Be sure you follow the Be Creative series. New video, video number 162 coming on today. 162 on the video on the Be Creative series. So everybody have a great day. Have some fun. I'll talk to you later. Have a great weekend. Mark Coleman from Paul's Photo, the lab at Paul's Photo and the Creative Photo Academy saying, peace out, baby. Take some pictures and I'll see you soon.